Now we ask you about some prayer meditations. Minister Gilbert shall lead us in prayer. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, we come before the Lord and we want to thank you right now, oh God, for our lives, our health, and strength. Lord, we thank you for all you've done for us. Now, God, we want to thank you for this broadcast, oh God, that's going out before the people. God, we pray that you bless our bishop and apostle Bishop Belton Green. Lord, we pray that you continue to keep them. Lord, God, continue to strengthen them. And even now, Lord, God, we pray that you look upon our assistant pastor, Bishop Melvin Samuels. God, as he go forth, Lord God, with thy word, that those that hear the word of God over the airways, my God, somebody would hear thy word and be pricked in their heart. Lord God, that they repent of their sins. My God, for we know you brought down your run and only true plan of salvation. Lord, that every man, woman, boy, and girl must repent of their sins, get baptized in the name of Jesus Christ for remission of their sins. Lord God, they must hurry to receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Oh God, and speak with other tongues that the Spirit of God give utterance. Now, God, we thank you for all things. We pray that you bless your people. Lord, keep us, help us, Lord God, to continue and for the faith. It's in your name we pray for all these things. And, oh, God, we thank you for doing it right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Friends and neighbors, you're tuned to the Bible True Gospel Radio Service coming to you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostolic Faith. Bishop Belton Green invites you to visit us here at the Headquarters Temple, located at 2075 Clinton Avenue, Bronx, New York City. Service Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Sunday, noonday. Now, in case you're interested in reading some biblical literature, the mailing address is Bishop Belton Green, P.O. Box 523, Bronx, New York, zip code 10457. It will be sent to you free of charge. Now at this time, it is my pleasure to present unto you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ, the next voice you hear, Bishop Melvin Samuel. Amen. Let the church say praise the Lord. Praise, God. praise the Lord again. Praise the Lord. Truly indeed again, we are bound to give great honor, praise to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Thank God. God, we do honor our very own beloved Bishop and Apostle, Bishop Belton Green. Yes. Thanking God for him again, allowing me this privilege to come before you all filling in his stead. Thank God for, for him and his great sacrifice. We thank God for the word of God that's going to live it and it's going to abide it forever. We do thank God also for that wonderful selection coming from the young adult choir. My God, I got happy here listening to them sing because I know that's a true song. He know just how to fix it. Oh, My yes. God, as they were singing, a scripture came to me in Matthew chapter 14 and verse 22, how he they were out there. The ship was tossed. Yeah, yeah. My God, but he, he, he went on. In, he went on out in the midnight hour. God can, there ain't no limitation where God not able to fix it. He's a God, he can fix it. I don't care how contrary it is. God can fix it. My God, just whenever you pray, let him have his way. I, God, no wonder we are so happy. God, no, we are a happy people. My God, the deacon sing, give the Lord a praise. My God, you know we have a right to praise God. We have a right to praise God. Praise I'm going to praise him. I'm going to praise him in the morning. I praise him late at night. My God, he know how to fix it. Oh, you yes. better let me go on before time fail me. In Ma Matthew chapter 14 and the 22nd verse. And straightway Jesus constrained his disciples. His disciples. To get into a ship. Get into a ship. And to go before him unto the other side. Yes. While he sent the multitude away. While he sent the multitude away. When he has sent the multitude away. When he has sent the multitude away. He went up into a mountain apart to pray. That's what I love about him. 
He was our example. The word of God said we should follow his step. Amen. My God, a lot of people that sing, they praise God. But when it comes to prayer, they don't, they don't give God. They don't, they, they don't pray. And Jesus said, men ought always to pray and not to faint. He went up into a mountain. A part to pray. My God, that's why I love prayer. We have all night prayer here, many Friday night. He, because he pray all night. He was our example. And he pray all night. People were filled with madness. But he didn't let that stop him from vision. praying. Amen. That's in Luke chapter 6 and verse 12. He didn't let that stop him. You can't let people, the wrath of God, work at not the righteousness of God. You can't let people get mad and stop you. In Luke chapter 6, I believe, and you can start from verse 11. And they were filled with madness. You see, they got mad in his days. You don't think they're going to get mad in our days? People get mad just for you living right. They get mad. They were filled with, with madness, madness. And commune one with another. People get aside and commune. One with another. One with another. What they might do to Jesus. Hallelujah. How can we stop him? I <laughs> God, but Apostle Paul, after all his fighting, he have to come on back and acknowledge we can do nothing against the truth, but for the truth. What can we do to Jesus? Otherwise, they want to stop him. Man. What can they do to Jesus? Praise God. And it came to pass. Yes. In those days. My God. God in those days yes, that he went out into a mountain to pray. You know, that's the key. That's the victory. Prayer. Prayer will fix it. He went up to the mountain, into a mountain to into pray. Into a mountain to pray. And continue all night in prayer Glory to God. To God, I love this. It inspired me to pray. God he continue you. all night in prayer to God. All night in prayer. My God, he said, men are always to pray not and to not pray. to faint. When sickness come, stay in prayer. When trouble come, stay in prayer. He will fix it going back to Matthew. Oh, let Jesus, let him fix it for you. I don't care what the condition, you can tell him to fix it. One place, David said, oh, Lord. My heart is fixed. You know, he, he know just how to fix it. Listen what the word of God says. And straightway Jesus constrained his disciples. The disciples. To get into a ship. Get into a ship. And go to, and, and, and to go before. Yes. Him unto the other side. Read on. While he sent the multitude away. While he sent the multitude away. And when he had sent the multitude away. Yes, sir. He went up into a mountain apart to pray. My God, if I got to pray, they sing a song all night long. I pray till the victory is won. You know, you can pray, you can pray, pray true. You can pray your victory true. Oh, yes. I pray. Yes. Hallelujah. We ain't going to stop praying. My God, we ain't going to stop fasting. He prayed. Went up into a mountain apart to pray. Oh, my God, have the saints ninth in the head and choose the morning from six in the morning to six in, in, the, in the evening. Twelve hours we believe in prayer and fasting. He went up. Yes. Up into a mountain apart to pray. To pray. And when the evening was come. My God, ain't no condition you go into. That he not able to see. When the evening would come. Yes he was there alone. He was there alone. But the ship was now in the midst of the sea. I don't care what you're going to. Oh. The ship. Was in the midst of the sea. In the midst of the sea. Tossed with the waves. My God whatever tossed in your life. 
He know how to fix it. Whatever, whatever in your life, whatever got you, something might be tossed in. My God, the ship was in the midst of, of the, the sea. sea. Tossed with the wave. Tossed with the wave. And the wind was contrary. Sometimes you heard things get contrary. Ah, uh, yes. But oh, he know just how to fix it. I don't care how contrary it get. God got the power to fix it. My God, whatever you're battling right now, it might look contrary. It might look bad. But you can tell God, Lord, I need you to fix it. I need you to fix it, Lord. This thing is very contrary. Yes. I'm battling it a long time. Sickness in your body. Tell God to fix it. I need you to fix it. My God, this thing get contrary. Whatever it is, my God, I don't care how contrary it is. You better back me up with some more Bible there. Before time fail me. In Matthew chapter 6, I believe in verse 31. God, he, he's the fixer. He got the remedy. That's why he tell you, take no thought. Don't worry about it. Just turn it over to Jesus. Just turn it over and walk away from it. He know how to fix it. Matthew chapter 6 and verse 31. Therefore. There, listen what the master said. Therefore. Therefore. Take no thoughts. And Mary said, you know what Mary tell him? Whatever he tell you to do, he said do it. He tell us, don't take no thought. Yes. But the devil is an enemy of all righteousness. He wants you to worry yourself. But if you can just turn it over to Jesus and walk away and let him fix it for you. Therefore, I say unto you. Take no thought. Do you hear what the master said? Don't take no thought. Yes. I don't care how contrary the thing get. He said, take no thought. Take no thoughts. Read on. Saying. Read on. What shall we eat? Read on. And what shall we drink? Read on. Or what shall with all shall we be clothed? Read on. For all these things do the Gentiles seek. All these things. Do the Gentiles seek. Hallelujah. For your Read. heavenly father. Wait a minute. I got a heavenly father. You got a heavenly father. You know we got a heavenly father. He loved to fix it for his children. He want to fix it for his children. Your heavenly father. Know what you have need of. Ah. Know what you Come have on, need Jesus. of. Come on, Jesus. Somebody said, fix it, Jesus. Fix it, Lord. Fix it, Lord. Hallelujah. I got a father. Hallelujah. His eyes is watching over us. Your heavenly Father. Know what you have need of. What did he say? He know. know. It. He know. Know it. He know. That you have need of all these things. God know. He know you already need it. But the enemy wants you to be upset and worry and fret yourself. But he said your heavenly Father. No, I got you have a need heavenly of all father. these things. I can bow my knees. I can talk to him in the midnight hour. Come on, Jesus. I need you to fix it for your people. Come on, Lord. Come see about us. Your heavenly father. Saints, don't worry about it. Don't even fret yourself. One place he said, fret not yourself because of evildoers, neither be thou envious against the workers of iniquity. For your heavenly Father know that you have need of all these things. He knows yes. that we have need of all these things. He know you need that thing. Whatever you're struggling with, it might look contrary in your life. But your heavenly Father know that you have need of all these he things. He know that we have need of all these things. But seek ye first the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. 
Just seek ye first. The kingdom of God is Seek after God. Seek after God. The kingdom of God. Yes. And his righteousness. And all these things shall be added unto you. The thing that you worry about. He know how to fix it for you. He know how to give it to you. Your heavenly father. Say all these things yes. shall be added. Go on Unto back you. before time. Fail me. Go on back where you left off in Matthew 14. On down past 22nd on down. What did he say? In the midnight hour. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. God know whatever toss in your life. Keep you awake at night. Somebody said trouble in my way. Hallelujah. I got to cry sometime. I stay awake at night, but that's all right. He, Jesus, will fix it. Just tell him to fix it, Lord. Yes. Read on. But the ship was now in the midst of the sea. In the midst of the Tossed sea. Tossed with the waves. Whatever tossing in your life, you need to seek after God. You that are out there, out there in the world of sin, try to make it without God, God Almighty, say without him, we can do nothing. My God, what you need, you need God in your life. You need to, to repent. You need to baptize in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sin. And you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Then the word of God say, they are perfect peace who mine is dead and God you got to keep your mind and God the wicked are like a troubled sea yeah. tossed to and flow ain't no peace no rest you need God in your life it was tossed, tossed with the waves with the wave for the wind was contrary whatever got you tossed in just turn it over to Jesus it's contrary contrary it's contrary amen it's contrary. Contrary. It's a lot of things you're going to run up against contrary. But you need to turn it over to Jesus. It's contrary. The fourth watch of the night. Read on. Jesus went unto them walking on the sea. What a mighty God. He can walk. He know how to get to you. He in the fourth night. They were out there Watching. in the midst of the sea. Watch. The wind was contrary. Yes. But here come the master. In the oh, he's the night. master. He can see you going through your test and through your trying of the faith. When no one see, he's a God that see it all. Hallelujah. Here come Jesus. Read on. In the fourth watch of the night. Yes. Jesus went unto them walking on the sea. You know, he can reach you. In your That's trouble, it. he can reach you. Walking on the sea. Yeah, and when the disciples saw him walking yeah. on the sea. Walking on the sea. They were troubled. They were troubled. Say, it is a spirit. It is a spirit. And they cry out for fear. Cry, cry out. Cry out for fear. You got to know how to cry out, but cry out to God. They cry out for fear. But straightway Jesus back unto them saying, Jesus spake unto them, saying, Be of good cheer. Oh, you know what? Just turn it over Be to him. Be of good cheer. Be of good cheer. It is I. Be not afraid. I'm encouraging you all that are out there. Try to struggle it and bear it on your own. You need to turn it over Hallelujah. to Jesus. God said, Be of good cheer. It is I. Hallelujah. Be it not is afraid. I. Be not afraid. Don't be afraid. What? Be not afraid. Be not afraid. Peter answered him. He read on. And said, I, Lord, God. if it be thou. Lord, if this you. Bid me. My God, he can make the impossible possible. He can make it so easy. Bid me yes. to come unto you. Oh, I want to walk on the water if this you. What is that? Yes, bid me. Bid me. Come unto thee to, on the water. I want to come walk into you on the water. And he said, what a mighty God. He can make, the, he can make it so easy, look so easy. Why? Because he said, my yoke is easy. And his birth, yeah, he said, let me come to you walking on the water. Yes. Read on. And he said. And he said. Come. Come. 
And when Peter was come down out of the ship, what? He walked on the water he, to go to did Jesus. Peter walk? He walked on the water. Quiet, walked sing, on the water. Sing from the quiet time, feel me. The problem is we try to struggle with it on our own. But somebody said, turn it over to Jesus. Turn it. God bless you. You better, yes. you better call us up. You better run on in here. You better run on in. You need help. You're struggling with it on your own, but you need help. You need help, beloved. This poor man cried. Hallelujah. The Lord heard him. God will hear and deliver you. Whatever you're buckling on your own, turn it over to Jesus. You might be down low, but the Holy Ghost said, let the brother of low degree, let him rejoice. God bless you, God. We'll you. be back next week, Lord's willing. The same station, same hour, the same day. You can call us at 718. 584-0691. That's right. And Turn it over. All you can call us via WhatsApp at 803-518-5454. You may also visit us on the web at www.theholytemperatures.net. Again, you can visit us on the web at www.theholytemperatures.net. Until then, may God richly bless you. It's our prayers. God bless you. God keep you. Turn it over, beloved. That's right. This is what you got to do. Turn it over. Turn it over tonight. God bless you. God keep you. You need to turn it over. Amen. Let the church say praise the Lord again. That's what we got to do, saints. I don't care how contrary it seems. It might be like a mountain. All you got to do, just turn it over. Turn it over. He know how to work it out. Turn it over. Turn it over. My God, turn it over. He know how to work it out. My God, you got to know how to turn it over. You got, you know, you can't always out talk the devil. But you can out pray. You can't always out talk the enemy now. You know, Hezekiah couldn't out talk Sinatra Rip. The more he talked, the more Sinatra Rip come at him. Sometimes the more you build up your confidence, the more the enemy come at you. Amen. Hallelujah to God. The more, you know, the more, the more Hezekiah talked and encouraged the people and built up the faith, then here comes the Nazareth. Oh, yes. What is it? Like a wind that talks. And what? Driven. Driven? It's that thing that angry sometimes. It's a Angry season. You so you so so do what? Take courage. Yes. You gotta encourage yourself. Uh, yes. And this highway of holiness, you gotta know how to encourage yourself. Something gonna come along and bother you. Something gonna come along and toss. 
But you got to know to tell yourself, soul, take courage. Why? I believe. I believe. I don't believe he brought me this far to leave me. I believe he gonna make a way. I believe my way of escape is already made. Even though I've been battered and been beat, but the Lord will make a way somehow. Somehow! Hallelujah! Somehow! Every child of God got to come out. You know the church cannot come behind. The church cannot we're not behind. It's Bible. I think that's 1 Corinthians 1 and 6. Even as a testimony. Of Christ was confirmed in this you. This thing is confirming us. It's, it's like I see people making cake. And they whip it and whip it and whip it and whip it. And mix it. Put the eggs and put all the ingredients. I used to watch Mother Sam, my wife, make cake. I don't know how it take a lot of patience to whip it and do this and whip it and knit it. And then all of a while, she said, don't let it fall. I don't know why it fall. They don't open the open door. It will fall. But it take a lot of patience. But after a while, the ingredients get built up and confirmed together. That thing, oh, it come out tasting so good. That's how even as a testimony. Of Christ was confirmed in you. You know, this is confirming every one of us saints. It's confirming in us you. in you. So that you come behind in no guilt. The church can never come behind. We on top. We are on top. I don't care how the devil fight. We are not behind. In no gift. So not we come behind. In no gift. In what? No gift waiting for the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. In no gift. We are waiting. For the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord Jesus Christ. Who shall also confirm you. You know this thing is confirming us. We come behind. In no gift, we are waiting. He put us above, and we're not beneath. You know, God, church is above everything. Yes, it we come behind in no gift. Yes. That's not what he said. Deuteronomy 28 and 1. Ain't going to hold you all long. I'm going to let you go. But I want to wrap it up so, you, so we know we are not behind. Amen. We above and not beneath. Yes, sir. Don't let the devil try to make you belittle and tell you, uh uh, he put us above how many people? All people. Deuteronomy 28. Listen what God has done to us, saints. I don't care how he tried. That's why he said, that's why James came behind and said, let the brother. Of what? Low. Sometimes you feel down so low. Yes. But James said rejoice. Rejoice in your lowest state. That you've been exalted. Because you can come behind. In no gift. Hallelujah. We above only. And not beneath. The church is not behind. My God, that's why we walk circumspectly. That's, right. that's why we don't link up with everything else. People want us to link up, but we can't link up. Yes. My God, because he put us above. And we didn't put ourselves there. Amen. My God, it pleased God to be our peculiar children. My God, his peculiar children. He gave a run on to Deuteronomy 28 1. What is it? And it shall come to pass. Read on. If thou shalt hearken diligently, just keep your eyes and God word. You will come out. My God, somebody said, You brought me, Lord. You paid the price. And I belongs to you. I'm going to do what you told me, what you want me to do. Read on. And it shall come to pass. Yes. If thou shalt hearken diligently, stay at it. Go at it 
diligently. Yes, unto the voice of the Lord thy God. And to the voice of the Lord your God. To observe and to do all his commands. Observe. He told Joshua, observe to do all that is in this book. You shall prosper and have good success. Yes. You can prosper in God. You can have good success. Amen. But observe. Observe. Do all, the, all his commandments. Do all his commandments. Command which I command thee this day. Command thee this day. That the Lord thy God will set thee on high. Who? The Lord thy God. You're going to find people come along, try to pull. But when God put you up, you're up. The Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. You better don't bother somebody that God. Don't bother God, people. <laughs> because we didn't put ourselves up. But God, all these young ones, and every one of them offering up the body, a living sacrifice, they didn't put themselves up. God put them up. Amen. God put them up. The Lord thy God. Set him high above all nations of the earth. Wait a minute. Above all nations? All nations of the earth. See, that's what caused them to get in trouble. In the days of Samuel, they said, we want to be like these other nations. Amen. When God put you up, don't go back and try to be like. That's it, Bishop. Am I right? That's right. That's what caused them to get in trouble. Oh, yes. God put them high above all nations. But they went back. Say, we want a king. Over. Why you want it? God is your king. But we want to be like other nations. Yes. We want to be like other. Uh, you got to watch that. That's why Paul, Paul was a wise man. Paul said, he, he came out the tribe of Benjamin. Paul said, I was a Hebrew of the Hebrew. <laughs> Paul said, I got a background. I must, might come from the least of the tribe, but I'm coming out the stock of Benjamin. Yes. I've been a Hebrew of the Hebrew, but Paul was no fool. Paul and were able to instruct them in 1 Corinthians 10 and 20. My God, you better start from the 19th verse. I'm hitting around and get out your way. For 10, 19, what did he say? Amen. First Corinthians, I believe, 10, 19. What say I? Why say, what say I? Then. Read on. That the idols is anything. Don't go after these idols. Anything. Yeah, or that which is offered in sacrifice to idols is to, anything. Is anything. But I say that Let, the thing that the Gentiles sacrifice. Listen what the man of God say. The thing that the Gentiles sacrifice. And he said he was a wise master builder. Even though he came out from the least tribe. But he said, I say. Yes, that the things which the Gentiles sacrifice. What which the Gentiles sacrifice. Sacrifice to devils. To devil. And not to God. And not to who? And not to God. God ain't getting nothing out of it. And what? Yes. Not to God. I would not that you should have fellowship with the devils. Do you hear what God said? The man of God said, I, I, I will, will not, not that you should have fellowship with devils. No, people get mad with us. He don't fellowship everybody because the Holy Ghost said don't have fellowship. Amen. I will not. That you should have fellowship with devils. How plain are you want that to be? That's it, Bishop. I will not. I will not that you should have fellowship with devils. He said, don't fellowship them. Yes. Don't fellowship them. Don't have fellowship. We can read on. Listen what he said. I would not that you should have fellowship with devils. Read on. Ye cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of devils. You can't get this good wholesome That's word it. and gone out with the devil. No. You cannot be partake of the Lord's table. This is so plain. And the tables of devils. How plain are you want it to be? 
He let you know you cannot God. over there playing with the devil and come back playing oh, for us. Come on, Bishop. Come on. That's the gospel. Come on, come on. You man. can't go around and play for the devil. That's it. And come and play That's for it. us. That's right. The choir God. gonna say, put away your music. I can't enjoy it. That's right. Hallelujah. Can two walk together except they, except they agree? I can't enjoy your music. My God, you, you get mixed up. You're playing for the devil and try to fit in with us. I will not. Come on, Bishop. Cannot. Is that plain enough? That's right. I would not. You cannot. What? Drink the cup of the Lord and <laughs> cup of Billy, devils. I can't do it. You know, I remember when Minister Billy and his group used to sing, Bishop Green hammering, hammer, Bishop Green keep hammering after why, Minister Billy. Well, we, we got to change this too. What's the matter? When you're ready to do right, that's it. You got to read it. You cannot. Can't. But I say the things if the somebody Gentiles. say you cannot, yes, that cannot mean you cannot. That's you right. cannot drink the cup of the Lord of the Lord and the cup of devils. And the cup of devils. You cannot be partakers of the Lord's table. Yes. You know that's a lot of boldness. Oh yes. You out there playing for the man and you come. Yes, You come in like, yeah. <laughs> like Elijah, Elijah's servant, Jehaiza. Where have you been? I've been on my post. I ain't been nowhere. I've been on my post. My God, the man of God, pick it up. Say, when not my spirit with you. When you meet Naaman, I'm saying, when not our spirit with you. When you're out there. <laughs> the eyes of the Lord yes. is in every place. That's it. You think God don't see you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you might get a little money for doing that. If there's a way that seems right, but look at the end result. It's death. You cannot. Ye cannot drink the cup of the Lord. Read on. And the cup of devils. You think we're going to fight you down and run behind you? No, sir. And set Chuck in the virus behind you? God Chuck in the Ah, uh, yes. Read on. Ye cannot, cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of devils. And the cup of what? Cup of devils. Cup of devils. Ye cannot be partakers of the Lord's table. How are you so bold? Oh, yes. Want to go out there and fit in with all these four and come. <laughs> Where have you been? Yeah, that's Your right. Skill. After a while, you're going to start losing that, what God gave you. Because God tell you, you what? Yes, you cannot be partake of the Lord's table. Yes. And the table of devil. That's, Do we provoke the Lord? You know you're provoking God. God, uh, he asks the question, are you so bold to provoke the Lord? When he told you no servant can serve two master. Do we provoke the Lord? The jealousy. Are we stronger than he? Are you stronger than God? Praise God. If God tell you no servant can do it, you say, I'm, I'm strong. I'm going to do it anyhow. <laughs> God, I never even meant to go here. But <laughs> late and went on to sleep, say, it's a warning. Somebody tried to provoke God. Not trying. They're oh, provoking God. Yes. Trying to partake mm -hmm. of God's table. Yes. And of the Lord's table. My God. 
close me out. I have to close out. I ain't going to hold you all much longer. But I think it's Ephesians. Is that Ephesians 5, 11 or 5, 15? Retouch it there. I will get it. What does it say? Ephesians 5? Yeah. 15, yeah. somewhere there. Amen. I will get it. See then. See then that you are circumspect. How? Circumspect. Yeah, yeah. Not as fool. Yeah. Not as fool. But as wise. As what? But as wise. You got to be wise. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Go Redeeming the time. Redeeming the time. The days are evil. It's, it's time to button down now. Get me Ephesians 5 and start at verse 6. Read on. Let no man deceive you with vain words. No, I don't care how to talk. You better get away from them. Oh, yes. Let no man deceive, deceive you with vain words. And that's what the Bible says in Revelation 20:10. The devil that deceived them. Cast in the lake of. Don't let no man come along. And deceive you with vain words. Deceive you with vain words. And because of these things come the wrath of God upon the, the children. The wrath of God of, is coming. Yes, upon the children of disobedient. You so disobedient. God tell you cannot do it, and you say I'm gonna do it. God say, I say you cannot do it, but you say I'm gonna try anyhow. I'm going to, I believe I can skip out, come back. But if Elijah were way there and, and pick up his servant, my God, the eyes of when, say, uh, me to let him get away with all this money? I'm going to run and overtake him. And I'm going to tell him, my master changes mind. Hmm. Give me a bank of them. He said, no, I will give you more than. But he got the money. But look what he went through to get it. He lied. That's right. Greed is not good. No, the sir. greedy after filthy lucre. But when he got back, his master said, where have you been? He have to tell. And when you tell one lie, you still have to tell the next That's one. Nice, he nice, have to nice, tell sir. another one. He said, I haven't been nowhere. He went and tell Naaman a lie. Now he come back to his master and know all the miracle God were. You not afraid to lie to a man of God? He went and said, where have you been? Master, I haven't been nowhere. You haven't been nowhere? Yes, I have been on my post. My God, the man of God turned. Elijah said, when not my spirit with you when you met Naaman and the three and, uh, to, and was it a time to receive money mm -hmm. and give my God all the leper that Naaman have Naaman was cleansed but that man uh, so he, he got a curse oh yes he amen. said the leper from Naaman going to cleave to you. And immediately he will white, he become leper. It's not good to disobey God's word. That's right. If you find yourself in, it's best to just humble down That's it, Bishop. and say, forgive me, I'm sorry. Go on back and finish me up. Ephesians, me. Ephesians 5 and 6, let no man Ephesians 5 and 6. Yeah. Let no man deceive you with vain words, for because of these things come the wrath of God. You see, people, upon the children people get are the wrath of God upon the children. Of, if he said, don't do it, he said, I'm not going to give my glory to another. That's what right. make you think you're going to go over there with your skill and play for them? Read on. Yes. The wrath of God upon the children of disobedience. Read on. Be not ye therefore partakers with them. Do you hear how plain this is? Be, ye, be God not ye said, therefore. Don't be not therefore. therefore. Partakers with them. God said, I don't want you to be partaker with them. Praise God. Read on. For ye were sometime darkness. 
Read on. But now are ye the light in the Lord. In the Lord. Walk as children of the light. Walk as children of the light. For the fruit of the Spirit is all goodness and righteousness and truth. Read on. Proving what is acceptable unto the Lord. Read on. And have no fellowship. That's it. Do you hear how plain it is? Have no fellowship with the unfruit works of darkness. If you, go, if you die and lose your soul, yes. they sing a song, it's nobody fault. But he told you, have, have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness. Why? But I rather reprove them. Because we are a peculiar people. Amen. He put us above only. You're not beneath. You're not beneath. The Lord our God chose us to be what kind of people? Special people. Above how many people? All nations. That's what he said. Walk together, children. Don't you get weary. Go over there. Look what God chose us and put us. He didn't put us beneath. He put us in Deuteronomy 28. And uh, he said, above. Above how many people? All nations. All nations that are up on the face. That's what he said. God bless you. God Amen. keep you. Walk together. Chill. Did you get it? Deuteronomy? I don't know. It's, huh? Yes. What is it? And the Lord shall make thee the head. You see, God put us to be the head. Yes. And what? And make the head and not the tail. We're not and the tail. shall be above only. You, do you hear where God put us? Yes. Why you want to run to be the tail? That's right. When you run over there to these four set of playing for them and going on. You know God is angry with you. Because God said, I put you above all people that are on the face of the earth. Make you above only and not beneath. He's going to make you the head yes. and not the tail. That's what he said. And the Lord shall make thee the head and not the tail. God make us. And thou shall be above only. Above, stay where God put us. That's it, Bishop. Let's stay where God put us. Amen. Let's walk together, children. Praise God. Don't you get tired? Read on. And thou should not be beneath. Are you tired? Be above. Hmm. You want to go beneath? My God. Read on. If that thou hearken unto the commandments of the Lord thy God. Read on. Which I command thee this day. To Read on. To and to do them. Yes. Thou shalt not go aside from any of the words which I command thee this day. To the right hand or to the left. What about the one? Of what about the one that said don't be partaker with them? What about the one that said have no fellowship? The works of God. God bless you. God bless you. Stop by.